So what we have here today is three devices. On the far right, this is MediaTek reference design, basically a reference platform. Um, on the left, two flagship devices that many will recognize. Um, and they're all playing the same video. They're all set on auto brightness, so basically the devices can do, do what they can do best under the circumstances, and we do have bright lights shining straight into their sensor, so this is a challenging environment. And what we're here is to observe how do the uh, devices handle this, this condition, and how does MediaTek technology with the smart screen uh, algorithm uh, turned on um, handles it differently. The video is the same. It goes through different ranges of video. It starts with a, with a white screen and then goes into gaming, etc. And so what you observe in here is that, of course, as in any game and any um, scene, you, some, some elements are not uh, as clearly seen as others, the shadows, etc., etc. But what a difference the smart screen makes. Well, let's take a look. Off, on, off. Little detail in the shadow, turn it on, the details come to life. No detail, no detail. What it looks like is we basically turn the brightness on. But what's shocking is that we actually do absolutely nothing with the backlight. The bright backlight stays exactly the same. And back, if we go back to the, to the original you know, white screen with the black letters, you will see that the brightness is exactly the same. What's different is the image enhancement. The image is actually compressed and enhanced pixel by pixel in real time to make it look brighter. But it really isn't. And that's what uh, allows us to preserve the power, save the battery, and give the, uh, the user the opportunity to enjoy the same performance as something that draws much more current, more power.